Hey everyone, my name is Lin Tan. I'm the principal of community and education here at Hypergetic and welcome back to yet another workflow tutorial. And today we're going to create this a lettuce child seat with a skin on top. So let's jump right in. I've already gotten this child seat's base model imported. And now let's go ahead and change the color up a bit for a lighter hue so that it's easier to see and save it. Now next, let's right click to rename this model to seat. So we also have a STL model of the shell or skin that is going to be in contact with the body and we're going to import it. And this is how it looks like. Let's once again change the color. And let's also rename this to skin. All right, then the next step will be to infill the seat with the BASF 4AM lattice. For the main object, we're going to select seat. So we're not going to modulate this lattice. So let's leave path to modulator map as default. Same goes for the material. And for the lattice pad, because we are dealing with a seat, let's select seating. So for the code that corresponds with the lattice unit cell size, let's select B and stiffness number one and confirm. Let's give it a moment to generate. And here you see that it's successfully generated. And this is how it looks like. So the entire volume of the original imported seed is filled with lettuce, leaving a skin that we've also imported on top. So let's go into the splitting plane mode in the Y negative direction to have a look at how they look like together. Seems to be in pretty good contact with each other, the skin and the seat. The last step that we have is to join them together as one object. And for that, let's go to the Boolean and union them together. So seat, skin and confirm. And once they're union, you can see that they're, they're one color, but let's change up the color so it's easier to see the lattice design. Enter and save. And there we have it. So that's it for the workflow and hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you're having any questions or trouble using high design, feel free to reach out to our team and we'll see you in the next one. Thank you.